Station. Bye. Sa tono ba ako? Hi everyone, this is Pau Diaz and welcome to my channel. In this video, I will be unboxing a musical instrument and I will be showing you what a person with no knowledge whatsoever about guitars or any musical instrument for that matter can achieve and as well as show you how I will set it up. So if you are interested to know and find out how far I can go, please continue watching this video. But before that, do give this video a like if this is something that you're interested in. And also, please do subscribe and hit that bell button so that you will be notified whenever a new video comes out. Let's begin by showing you the item. This is a classic guitar that I bought online. I had to reach out to a few of my friends as well as my relatives to help me find a guitar online. I only have $100 budget for it. We choose to go for a classic guitar which is normally what a beginner would go for and then there's also a choice of whether you're going to buy a nylon type of string or the steel type of string and I believe they say that it is less painful but I guess it's the same for beginners like us. Um, disclaimer, I have played guitar in the past. I somehow know how to play. I haven't touched a guitar for seven years. And this is going to be my first time since then. So the next thing is the size. There are four sizes of guitars. Um, one, four, two, four, three, fourths, and the full size. Um, I was thinking of getting a full size. We ended up getting the three-fourth size because we are considering maybe Lucas would want to use it as well. So yes, this is a three-fourth size guitar. We bought it online in Lazada and it costs $89 because it's on sale. And I bought a few other things as well. I bought um, a couple uh, which is $5. And I also bought a guitar stand, which costs $19. In total is $113. I was a bit out of budget, but um, that's fine. Um, because I bought some accessories. Yay! Let me just grab a scissor. Here we go. And now we are ready. Let's start with the smaller packages first. This is the capo. I actually bought two because the other one is for my friend. So and because it's so cheap and it's on sale, I decided to buy her one as well. And this is the item. We'll try, it. we'll try it out later. And then next is the guitar stand. There is no instruction manual. I guess maybe it's self-explanatory. Let's we'll see. So this is the guitar stand. Um, I'll just put it here on one side. And now on to the guitar. Shift my camera downwards. The guitar has a manual in it, a care card. Blue, black, and orange. And and it 
also has a free bag. Um, I feel like it's too small or maybe it's just been a while since I last saw a guitar. Mm. So the guitar inside is still wrapped. Sorry, there's a glare. Okay. So the strings are all nylon. This three right here doesn't look like it, but inside is actually nylon strings um, covered in steel coil or um, that's what they call it. At least that's what I know. <laughs> I will not be able to tell you much about a guitar, but I'm just so happy. It feels really nice. It looks very sturdy. Now, how are we able to tune a guitar? <laughs> Some people would know how to do it without anything, but my friend asked me to download Guitar Tuna. Guitar Tuna, and let's see how. All right, I'll just try my best. All right. <laughs> it says it's too low you tighten the string if it says it's too high you loosen it i just had to explain it to myself Every beginner should know this. All my bags are packed. I'm ready to go. I'm standing here outside the door. I hate to wake you up to say goodbye. And the taxi's waiting outside the door. Something, 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 something. La la la. said you just have to build up the callus on your fingertips and all will be fine oh we forgot to try out the capo sit here and there you go fits nicely a capo is these are all googled all right a capo is the short form for capotasto it means head of the neck this is used to change pitch of the guitar um, if we put it here on the second fret right there it would raise the note one whole tone shift I'll just try it okay all my bags are packed I'm ready to go I'm standing here outside the door hate to wake you up to say goodbye that is what it's for and I love it I always use it before because whenever I sing a song even up to now I record my song in garage garage band I record my song in garage band and I would always change the pitch of the song because most of the songs are not not in my range or maybe I'm just not pushing myself hard enough but yes it's my secret. I always change the pitch of my instrumentals, but that's our little secret. And so 
I would need this because I'd probably be doing it when I'm playing the guitar. So, yes, guys, that's it for today. That's it for this video. I hope you guys learned something or I hope I have encouraged you to buy a guitar if you're wanting to buy one or if you're wanting to learn. It's pretty simple. It's pretty easy. You just need to know um, what kind of guitar you want to get first. We would normally recommend to get a classic guitar and um, the size of the guitar depending on your height, your age. And this I think is a good buy. It already has a bag carrier uh, along with it it also has free picks and a capo i if you need to buy one to shift your um, the tone or raise the tone or lower um, you could do so it's pretty cheap but if you're starting to learn uh, to play the guitar i i think this is not really mandatory um, but yes and tuning a guitar is now so simple just need to use an application and it would tune your guitar for you and so that is it i hope you liked this video you learned something new i have encouraged you to try something new and be sure to look out for videos with me playing my guitar bye thank you all so much for watching